Hey Scorpios, what's up? It's your girl, the Shaqueen, the guidance goddess, okay? You can reach me doing personal readings for you, keeping it real, helping you heal on my business page, Shaqueen, the guidance goddess, and my YouTube channel, subscribe, Shaqueen, the guidance goddess, Scorpios, my heart is so heavy when it's come to y'all reading. It's like woosa. Why is my horse so heavy, Scorpio? Hmm. Yes, let's go ahead and jump into it. Because my horse is heavy. My nerves is bad. Jesus Christ, what would you like to illuminate to my Scorpio Collective Facebook? Thank you, Jesus Christ. I've already shuffled. You are needing to cut off people and places that no longer serve you. You are needing to cut off past people. Okay? Start start putting out good energy so you can receive it back. Okay? Right now, you're waiting on your something to come in. Okay? Something... You've been meditating and praying on. You're waiting on it to come in. You've been sitting by yourself. Okay? You've been waiting on something to come in. Give me more for the Scorpio Collective. Yes. Uh, something drastically changed your life. Something happened. Okay? And you had to be truthful and honest with yourself during this situation. Where your life changed, drastically changed. You didn't see this coming that far. You had to leave a situation behind and, 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 and watch it happen, you know. You didn't want to see it happen, okay? You know, you were stable. You felt stable. You felt grounded. You felt like you had your money all together, but something drastically happened, Scorpio, that made you figure out your worth and who you are. Or maybe with an empress or someone you love, uh, or maybe a mother, there was conflict and debate, competition. Looks like to be five people. Okay, um, you had to be your authentic self now. You had to be true to yourself, okay, and and make decisions wisely when it comes to people you love and trust. Okay, give me one more. It's you need to balance yourself out, Scorpio. You got a lot going on. Things have changed tremendously. Made you have to leave situations behind. Okay, you, you had to, you had conflict and debate, maybe a love interest or maybe a mother, someone who's very nurturing, okay, where you had to be your authentic self, okay, you had to be true to yourself, you had to be pure, you had to balance yourself out, balance is needed, balance is needed, okay. I feel like people were showing you uh, different types of love and all of them wasn't real. You had to be true with yourself. Give me more on this tower cord. You were bored and lacking. You um, actually missed a blessing when it came to this tower. You didn't see your blessing. Or maybe this tower made you feel abandoned, left in the cold, made your money low, had to make you jump out on a leap of faith, do something new. And it made you stuck mentally. Yeah. It's like you're blindfolded and you're wrapped around with rope around swords, okay? You are stuck mentally behind this situation. What are you waiting to come in? Give me more on the three of wands. Your heart is broken, okay? Because you are waiting on something to come in. Give me more. 
you are having the courage and the strength to keep going, okay? To give someone some love the right way, the righteous way, and have a new beginning, a new book, start a new book of your life that's going to bring you nothing but happiness, Scorpio, okay? You've been having anxiety, okay? You've been losing sleep at night. Okay, you've been praying on a particular situation. You know, things drastically changed in your life. You didn't see it coming. Okay, it made you feel abandoned. It made you feel like you were were lacking something. Okay, maybe you feel like you missed a blessing. Okay, but the blessing is in disguise that the reason this tower has came and it's coming to me is because you're going to take a, a, a leap of faith and do something new with your life. Okay, okay, stuff that you've been, you was blindfolded or you are blindfolded and tied with rope mentally but you can easily take that blindfold off okay and that rope from around you you your heart is broken okay but you have the courage and the strength to keep going scorpio okay to give this person you love the mutual love that they deserve and and and, and it's gonna start a new beginning for you give me more on this six of cups it's true love, yes. A very, very strong connection, okay? And you are working hard to get this back, okay? You want to be stable and grounded with this person. I see soulmate energy, queen of pentacles, king of pentacles. You see that you breadcrumb this person in the past, and you just want to have a new beginning on giving them the love that they deserve, the divinely guided love that you feel like that you can give, okay? You having to cut people off in old situations and things that no longer serve you to do what you have to do to love this person correctly, and you are willing to do that, even though you've been hurt and you've been very emotional you have a solid cup of love to give this person and you're willing to do something different and jump out and be your true self okay and heal yourself okay from being stuck and blindfolded and feeling abandoned and just having the courage and strength to love correctly and do it the right way scorpio okay oh that was that was straight up like your life drastically changed and it was for you to love who you supposed to love correctly. You was not loving that person correctly, Scorpio. It is what it is. I'm illuminating everything. You know what I'm saying? But it's a breakthrough for you. Like, it's a bad towel, but it, it's going to come out to be good. You feel what I'm saying? Because you get to love this person. You, you get to know that this person really loves you. And you need to love this person correctly. You need to do... What's best for you? You need to cut out people that no longer serve you, Scorpio. Here is some inspiration. All right, for the Scorpio Collective. Why do I feel like it's a piece of her? Stuff is annoying you, Scorpio. People are annoying you. Situations are annoying you. Okay, and you sick of it. Dang, this piece of her. People are getting on your nerves. Jesus. Don't have me pull off my legs trying to get this little piece of her. Taurus, I do Taurus next for you, baby. I got you. I promise. All right, Scorpio Collective. Hasmos, Haggai, Jesus Christ, Angels, and Ancestors. This is for the Scorpio Collective. You need some inspiration for the Scorpio Collective. You need to embrace joyful opportunities, okay? Welcome, new love, and trust what it brings, Scorpio, okay? Look, don't keep running from that love. That love is real. Now, trust your ideas and your direction, okay? <coughs> Surrender and know how to go forward, amen? Okay, surrender. Like, know that what the way that you were going was not the right way and that you want better, you're going to do better, and you're going to surrender and know how to go forward. I am proud of what I achieved, and I accept my rewards. So you should be a, a proud of what you achieved, okay? Accept your rewards. 
Accept that God gave you a person to love, an unconditional love, I'm hearing. Embrace joyful opportunities, even if it's not a particular person. It could be particular uh, places or situations. I just love within self, okay? Embrace joyful opportunities and trust your ideas and your direction. Can I have more for the Scorpio Collective? Dang, you went through a whole tower moment. Because you had to understand that you needed to love a particular person, right? And God stopped you in your tracks, whatever he did. I don't know. I don't know you. I'm just keeping it real. The Lord just let me know that Jesus stopped you in your tracks like, hey, 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 hey. You got a real one over her. So don't play no games when it comes to this one. So embrace it. Amen. Jesus didn't have to give you a, a good love, a divinely guided love. You better love that love like you would want to be loved. What you put out there comes back. I recognize that I have chosen fur and I choose again. I choose love. Amen. Choose love. Look at these cords coming out. I do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness. So you're going to change some things, cut off some people, and do what you need to do. And, and, and love this person that God has chosen for you. You know this is your soulmate. So that's when the tower comes. When you know this person is for you, this person has done no wrong, and you cross them, things happen. Okay? Hope is the, conduit, the conduit for miracles. Hope. Hey, man, quit playing. I don't care about none of it. I can't pronounce it right now. But it's the hope for miracles, okay? The key to prayer is to forget what I think I need. So forget what you think you need and just ask God to fulfill you and give you what he wants you to have, okay? Like, don't, you don't have to keep going. That was an unnecessary tower, that was an under, but you gotta, you live and you learn. But don't continue to put yourself through that. If you don't want to be with a person, if you don't want to love that person, let that person go. Don't leave that person on, because then that's when things crumble. When you don't do it the God godly way. Period. I'm just being honest. There's some love oracles for you, Scorpio. Scorpio Collective. Love oracles for Scorpio Collective. Let's look. Past most high God, Jesus Christ, angels and ancestors. Clear active messages for the Scorpio Collective. Whoa. Go slow. Take the time to get to know each other. So maybe you don't even really know this person. Get to take the time to get to know this person, okay? This is your true love. Like, don't play this person, Patty. The timing is quite not right. Quite, the timing is not quite right. This rejection was actually a divine protection. Woo wee! What I tell you? What did I tell you? Woo wee! That was powerful. This love is emotional, physical, and unconditional. It's true love, y'all. Do not cross your true love. Do not. Let them go. <coughs> you and this person don't share the same vision. So you and that person was not sharing the same vision. And then that's why this tower moment came. Because you was not looking at it and doing... What she was supposed to do. Sure, it's for another Scorpio. If it don't resonate, if it do resonate, just sure this live because this is deep. <clears throat> Scorpio, you actually went through something that drastically changed your life because you did not love correctly a divinely guided person. Somebody that God chose for you, you did something that you did not love them correctly in some type of way so where a tower moment came and it was actually a divine protection for you to notice that this person is really your true love oh my god so take the time to get to now you know what look on everything i love scorpio my heart was so 
heavy when I started y'all reading. But right now, my heart is getting so light because it's really beautiful. Like, it hurts so bad what you just, what you was going through, what you're going through. But it's a beautiful ending. Like, you know that this is your true love, your soulmate. You know what you did to create this tower moment. You are going to learn from your mistakes. Embrace joyful opportunities, okay? Surrender and know how to go forward. Now that you've seen what you've seen, and now that you know it's real for the Scorpio Collective Facebook, let's shuffle. Hey, Scorpios. Look, love is blind and it'll take over your mind. What you think is love? I don't even know, but love is blind, y'all. Like, you ain't even see it. That's cute, though. I'm not even mad, Scorpio. That's what's up. Learn from your mistakes. That's it. Remember to practice self-love. Always self-love, okay? Focus on yourself. That's, that's why you went through it, too. You had to... Focus. Focus up. Yeah, you got the love of your life, but you need to focus on yourself, too. Because you did something you weren't supposed to do. And you felt that. You felt that. You felt that, Scorpio. It's okay, because you live and you learn. Okay? Confidence. It comes with time and practice. Okay? You will grow the confidence that you want to grow. Time and practice. Lavender, okay? Somebody's favorite color could be lavender. Surround yourself with love, okay? Surround yourself with people that truly love you, that accept you for who you are, that's real, that's genuine. It's sour moment made you see who really loves you, Scorpio. I'm being honest. Let them go. <clears throat> Let them go. Let them people go. Let them situations go. Let them past memories go. Let them go. Angels, what would, what do you have to say to the Scorpios? It's okay, though, because it was actually, the rejection was actually a divine protection. So, it's really a beautiful thing, Scorpio, for real. You need a sure slide. Because we all, ain't nobody, ain't nobody perfect. Mm-mm. Angels, what do you have to say to the Scorpio Collective? Clear, accurate messages. Thank you, Jesus. Angels, in the near future, if you believe <clears throat> in proven health, in the near future, if you believe, so only if you believe, And you know what? It don't even have to have your sign. It don't have to be your sign. It You could have like this sign in your chart. You know, your moon, your sun, your rising. You know what I'm saying? Like you got to really study your birth chart. So really signs don't really mean nothing for real, for real. We all connected. But since they split up, split us up in signs, you might feel it. You might feel it too, because we all going through the same thing, different situations. But you know, each sign, it gets deeper in debt. You might feel it a little bit more if it's your typical sign. But it does say, if you believe in the near future, if you believe, it's what you believe. You got the power to believe what you want to believe, and that will happen, okay? In the near future. Improving health is needed in the near future. Thank you. Sure, it's live, even though, like I said, if even if it's not your side. I just want some support, y'all. I do it because I love y'all. For real, for real. You feel what I'm saying? This is from Jesus. Has most high God, Jesus Christ, angels and ancestors. Clear, accurate messages. Okay? For the Scorpio Collective. Facebook. Beautiful Scorpio. I am proud of what I achieve and accept my reward. Accept your reward, Scorpio. Okay, it's it, it's show season. Happy birthday, Scorpio. Quit playing. Yes. 
Yes. Yeah, file before you bow. You hear what I'm saying? Give me a correct message for my Scorpio collective. Dang, you got three. Loyalty. Being loyal to yourself and others. Jesus. Trap. You may feel trapped, okay? But you will be released, okay? What I'm saying? Where you can release yourself. You just got to believe, okay? Then you get success. Congratulations. So I'm going to read success to you, okay? 39. Jesus, look, show it out. Okay, like I said, it turned out to be good. It's a tower moment that you didn't see it being good, but it really was for your best benefit. You are divinely guided and protected. Let me find out. Okay, he wants the best for you. He just wants you to recognize, learn from your mistakes. Okay, that's it. You must celebrate now as I do, for you have achieved success, Scorpio. Accomplishments are yours now, and you are in a position to reap the rewards of your hard work. The symbol of success reminds you that hard work pays off, okay? Being true to yourself and refusing to compromise will yield good things. Choosing this symbol is a wondrous sign, okay? Choos choosing this symbol is a wondrous sign that all is well in your life. The symbol requires you to keep working hard lest you lose the knowledge you have gained. Now is not the time for slacking off. Keep going and celebrate even the smallest victory, Scorpios. Be proud of yourself as I am proud of you. Remember, everything you choose now will come to be realized. So choose wisely. Congratulations, Scorpio. Oh, I'm going to cry. That is beautiful. I'm not even lying. I, I done did, I think, about six signs. And it ain't never just flip like that. The energy just stuck. But you are believing that what's for you is for you. You are having faith. You are praying. And I'm getting the chills because you really are. And things is changing. Things is changing. Things is changing. I love you. I am your queen, the goddess goddess, okay? I'm here to keep it real, help you heal. You can get a personal reading from me at my business page, okay, on Facebook, Shaqueen the Goddess Goddess, and make sure you subscribe to my YouTube, Shaqueen the Goddess Goddess. I need all y'all support and love, you feel me? Scorpios, I'm proud of you, okay? Remember, what you believe, you shall receive. They didn't, they didn't just make that quote up. It's real. Believe it. Believe it. Believe that that, that that's your soulmate. Believe that's your true love. Believe that you can make a change. Believe that you can do better. Believe that you can let go of past people and situations and addictions and, 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 and just all of that. Just believe it. It'll come true. I promise you. You feel me? I'm Shaquina Goddess Goddess. I'll see you next video. I got you, Taurus. You up. Bye. Maybe a Taurus could be significant. I'll see you in a second. Bye-bye.